Big bada boom. All right. Hey right, guys, my name is Ben. This is Andrew. And we're continuing with Dr. Stone, season one, episode 15. Go ahead and uh, do the thing. So we, last episode, uh, we were still in the tournament. Uh, what's the name of the tournament again? The exact words? It's the Grand Bout, uh, The Bout, Grand right? Bout, yes. Yeah, the Grand Bout. And um, was, was Genro's fight in the last episode or just Chrome's? I can't remember if Genro's fight was in the last episode also. So then Genro... did, did it, oh, did yeah, it those, start... that's when he went full Chad mode, I think. Yeah, 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 with the caffeine in his system because he ate the leaves or whatever. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and he went crazy and he knocked the dude off the side, but he thought he looked all buff and bad, but really he got all beat up because the dude was cracking him. We just didn't go down. <laughs> and I don't, but, I, don't, uh, I don't know if you said it, but he was like hyped up on like caffeine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, yeah. he ate like he ate, like straight tea leaves or something like that. Yeah, was, it was like just like pure ingredients. Yeah, yeah. Like un, was, unchanged. Yeah. So, yeah, he had a little caffeine uh, high and then ended up winning his fight. So then we cut back to Chrome's fight, who is now fighting Magma, and he was absolutely getting slaughtered, obviously. And then mid fight, he does something and he actually threw what's his name off? Um, threw Senku off because he turned around with the rest of Suika's, um, Suika's uh, helmet that was crushed. Mm -hmm. And he just like started like holding it on magma, like in front of him. And then Senku's like, I don't think he realizes how long it's going to take him to catch this dude on fire because the way the lens is. And he goes, unless, cause they or he didn't even say that at first. He kind of like, was like, what is he doing? And then he realized, Oh, unless he, he had collected the sweat in the lens to make uh, it come through. Close, point. close, close. You, like you, that, you, right? almost, you almost have it. Um, yeah. He said that won't work, and then Chrome was like, "I'm a science user too," and then that's what got him thinking. Oh, that's right, that's right. He's right. He's yeah, yeah. a science user also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He goes, oh, unless he collected sweat. Yep. Yeah. And then in the middle of that, um, Gin showed back. Or yeah, is that his name Gin? Yeah, yeah Gin yep. came back. Gin came back, and he was the, he's the supposed sorcerer that everyone yeah. was talking about. So he then also used that to his uh, Chrome's advantage to buy Chrome time. Mm -hmm. And he hopped up on the on one of the whatever you want to call them huts or whatever, and was like, "Hey, I'm back! By the way, magma, you didn't kill me, and also I'm casting a spell on you right now, to where if you take a step forward in any direction or move at all, your heart's gonna explode and you're gonna die. But I can only hold it for so long because you're just so strong. So he uh, that gave uh, Chrome the sixty seconds he needed to catch him on fire, but." he had to keep it still at the same time. So he was able to do it. He caught my man Magma fire. He ended up winning the fight. And now all we have left in the grand bout is uh, Senku, uh, uh, Genro, and Chrome. So, and I'm led to believe from what I've seen that they're probably just going to kit. Obviously, Genro is probably going to beat Senku because Senku is just going to throw the fight. And then Genro is probably just going to let Senku or uh, Chrome win. So Chrome can be a three. -ree. That's what I'm guessing. That, that, but yeah, that's probably. I do, I do have a question. How can someone take a step in any direction forward? Oh, is you that said, what he said? You said? No, you said. Oh, well, you said t take a step forward in any direction. Oh, like what well, other direction can you go? Yeah, it's my fault. Don't take a step in it. Don't, don't make it. I should have. I should have said, don't take a step. Okay, I, I just said that wrong, all right? Dude, take a step forward in any direction. Like, wait, what? Yeah, you, you, can't, you, can't, you can't spin around and listen, step forward. Listen, yeah. I wouldn't be a friend if I didn't insult him, all right? Yeah, Come on. All right. Come it's on. Right. Right. <laughs> I definitely worded that wrong, but yeah, you know what I meant. You all know what I meant. All right. And yeah. go ahead and head to the link in the description below for the reaction. All right. <laughs> the village is named after him, bro. Ishigami. Ishigami. Ishigami Village. Bro. Name. His name is Ishigami Sinku. Oh, wow. And, and Japan, they do the last name, then the first name? I was going to say, Sinku still his first name. So, yeah, yeah. yeah I, I, I'm just saying how they said it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I got you. I, yeah, I understand. Yeah, yeah I, I remember the difference. Yeah. But man, Ishigami, bro. How does she know the name? I've known about you for a while now. What? What? <laughs> oh, I'm, it has to be her dad, his dad, right? 
like maybe they bumped into his dad and his dad was like if my son ever is is ever breaking from the petrification he'll be the one to save us all or something like that maybe i don't know 3700 years ago i mean his dad was petrified also i'm just saying maybe oh I see. Who do you say? Or these people not been petrified? Is that the question? Is that what you're telling me? Um, that's the conclusion that Zukasa came up with. Oh. And they they don't think they don't know what science is, but they know what uh, sorcery is, or they think they know what sorcery is. So he believes that these people were never petrified, or that they were only petrified for X amount of time. Maybe. I'm sure no one in there knows about the future, so or like about the pre or you know the past. I guess I should say. Um, how do they know about Senku then? I was just saying maybe their dad, his dad was un, like got unpetrified, and he bumped into this village, and then he told them about his son Senku. Is that Senku, is that your theory? I'm guessing. I mean, I, I it has to be someone from the past talk to them. Or maybe I don't know, man. I have well, no who, idea. Well, who is them? The the Ishigami Village. Okay. Well, Ruri, I guess, because she's the one that specifically said she knows the name Senku. But her and Kawaku are twins. I don't know. I couldn't tell you, bro. I couldn't tell you. I mean, I will tell you the. Uh, I will clarify um, Ruri's position in the village. She is the priestess. Yeah, she is the priestess. Uh, it's supposed to be uh, Kohaku because uh, Ruri was dying. It's supposed to be passed on to her, but Kohaku said no. <laughs> I'm stumped. I, I, I'm stumped. <laughs> I will uh, go back a little bit further. Uh, when they were in the river, uh -huh. um, collecting using the the magnet rocks. Yeah. Um. And then they brought up that that uh, video game looking character, yeah. with like the different uh, like alligator, bear, lion, yeah, like yeah. all of that. Um, they're like, yeah, that's that's what uh, Ruri told us. Yeah. So absolutely. Ruri's the one who told it, and she said, "Yeah, I know most of my big words from Ruri." And Ruri, so Ruri has either been informed or never knows somebody. That no one else knows about that she has met someone that knows about the past but apparently no one else in the village has met him I don't know who she's met I well really she she doesn't ever leave the uh, the village the village really but she so. said it's for her words right there when she got her but legs back what's, what's the objective of the, uh, the grand bout to have someone marry the priestess and become the head chief Okay, and then, what? And then, how did uh, Ruri get the position of priestess? She was the child of the the chief. Okay. So when Ruri has a kid, that person will become the priestess or priest. And then when they have a kid, they'll 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 be the priest. It's a lineage. So... It's passed down. It can't be her dad. I mean, her dad doesn't know who Sinku was until Sinku was brought up. Dude, I couldn't tell you. Like, I, I, it must be head. No, it must be over my head because I have no idea. <laughs> Literal no idea. Jokes on you. It doesn't matter. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> okay, right, so we had um. <laughs> maybe, maybe it is his dad who bumped into him. I don't know, bro. <laughs> I don't know. We had, we had Ginro not able to read anything. She was like, she was like, oh, you know, we're gonna we're gonna let uh Chrome win. Does this sound good to you? And she was like, I can't I can't like agree to that in the priestess. So she's like, yeah, it doesn't matter who I married. I'm, I can't right, right. I can't have such emotions. Blah blah. blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, wait, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everyone was like, bro. Yeah, and then they basically said, yo, let me hit you in the nuts right quick. Everyone was just like, anyone but him. Uh, <laughs> Any, but him anybody. We'll take anybody. Because yeah. he was the most physically adept out of the three. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. So once Magma yeah. went out, it was, in terms of physicality, he was the strongest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, was, <laughs> yeah, he was the actual fighter out of the three. And then there was this super good moment right here. So he puts, like, the handle, yeah, and yeah. then more of the, uh, the stick is yeah, on so that side. Just, so he just steps on it and hits him with the balls. Bow! Yeah, I like the hopping hits. Like, what? Boom. So, like, right oh, yeah. here, you look at the handle. Yeah. And it goes about this far. And this is the same amount. So, if the end is going 20, 25, about right here is going 25. Yeah. But because this is much farther out, it's multiplied. So, that's why it's going yeah, five yeah. times. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's great. It's called inertia. Yeah. I'm sure you're familiar with it. And so. this man, he's like, yo, Chrome, it's all yours, big yog. All right, it's the final now. And he's like, because <laughs> he at that point he was like, oh, science wins. Yeah, yeah. So he didn't have like a need to necessarily go on. It so. kind of makes sense that Frank <laughs> wins. Yeah. This, this is the best moment of the episode, bro. Like he, that is the most savage thing ever. He said, well, well, if it isn't the former villain chief. <laughs> Sink is gutted, bro. The disrespect. That's so disrespectful. That is so disrespectful. I mean, it's disrespectful for the other guy to be talking to Sinku like this. He's the new chief. What do you think you're talking to? <laughs> He's like, what are you, a nobody? Like, bro, come on. Step out of that'd here. Be like, that'd be like the thing where, like, the uh the you know how like the presidents like they uh do usually the former president will like shake the new president's hand it's like it's like it's like <laughs> if that happened and then like while they were on stage the former president said something and then the new president just kicked them off the stage like <laughs> like just physically like like kicked them off the stage like shut your mouth former president you have no, you have no say <laughs> I, yeah uh, I, I think oh, yeah, a much yeah. better one would be like, if you went back to, like, the medieval days with, like, the kings, like, if you killed oh, the king, yeah, you became the king. Yeah, yeah, So it's back. just like, whoa, look at you. Didn't you lose to me? It's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. If, they didn't have to, if they didn't have to kill him. Dude, Sinku's, Sinku's goaded. So he pretty much just like, yeah, uh, she's dying. Uh, we need the alcohol. And he was like, mm, divorce. <laughs> because <laughs> to him, this isn't even a wedding. He hasn't even gotten really married. Yeah, yeah, he was exactly. just going by their rules, not like, yeah, yeah. not like his rules. His rules, yeah, you know, yeah. the marriage is yeah. also obviously different. Yeah, so um, yeah. he goes and boom, he creates a carbonation machine. Yep. Puts some uh, some pneumonia. They work on the drug. You know, yeah, my man, getting the soda. Getting baby. Getting's like, yeah. He's like, yo, you should definitely make me a soda question mark. And that's awesome that he uh, he set it up so Gin could come, and then there's a. Uh, a perfect little bottle of cola for him. And it's cold too. Yeah, you can see yeah. the uh you can see the, the like the yeah, the ripples from being cold. Yeah. Gosh, what is that what is that called? Condensation. Condensation. Yeah, yeah, you can, yeah, you, can yeah. Uh, you can see the condensation on it, which means Gorg it's cold. Gorgeous. And it, it's Gorgeous. it's Senku Cola, my guy. Senku Cola. That was a real yeah. recipe. That was a real recipe he gave us. So then they yeah, uh yeah. they fed Ruri the uh the medicine. Yep. And then I want to see that. And she just books it. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> She's been sick forever. Yeah, then, yeah. <laughs> I guess it runs in the family. Uh, yeah. yeah. So yeah, she yeah, yeah. was always like that. She was just yeah. sick. So she couldn't be like that. <laughs> yeah. That's crazy. Uh, freaking glorious, dude. And then uh, she's like, yeah, I always knew about you. Um, Ishigami uh, Senku. Yeah. Hmm. Oh, she knows yeah. She knows Senku. Which she said before, but now she like, it's like, yeah, I've always known you for a long time. So. <laughs> what if his dad was the original, like, chief of the village? And that's why it's called Ishigami uh... Village. And then, like, his secrets were passed down. And there is a, there is a, there is a, a, a prophecy of a boy named Senku, his child. <laughs> and one day, Senku Ishigami would show himself. And he would 
be a leader, a healer, a sorcerer slash sciencer. <laughs> <laughs> a great sorcerer shall shall emerge from stone. Yeah, exactly. And bro. banish any sort of natural um physical attack. Yeah, exactly. He's like, yo, I don't know any of this stuff, but like I definitely bought my son who's definitely stoned somewhere right now in the world a bunch of gear to learn and you know become a crazy scientist. So like, yeah, he probably could help us with this, but right now I don't know where he is and I'm probably gonna die before he comes back. But you know, just know my son he'll come back one day and he'll be, he'll be all right. <laughs> we don't know we don't even know if he's still on this continent or where we're at where he's at. But you know, one day Senku, you'll know the name. Just remember that name. Just know that that name will come up at some point, somewhere, somehow. <laughs> just, <laughs> just keep telling everyone yeah, that yeah, Senku's yeah, coming. Yeah, some Senku's yeah, coming yeah. to town. Pass, pass it down to every priestess that, or priest slash priestess that they. Uh, there's a person named uh, Senku that will sh- arrive at some point, somewhere, somehow. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Solid guess. Solid guess. All right. So we're going to uh, move on. Right, if you guys would like to support us, liking, commenting, subscribing really helps. Even if you don't have anything to say, just drop a drop a hi, and I'll talk. I'll give you a comment back. Um, also, Easy links in the descri- links in the description, and uh, check out the Patreon if you want to uh, further support us and check out what we're doing in the future. But now we'll oh, yeah. see you all in the next one. Deuces.